My name's Elizabeth Lomas. I'm an Associate Professor in Information Governance within the Department of Information Studies. Um, I teach across programmes. I come from a practice basis, so I worked as an information manager in a range of public and private sector contexts, including um, libraries, museums, um, government, commercial entities such as banks. Um, and um, I continue to do a bit of consultancy today, but my main focus is teaching modules from across programme. So um, I teach creation and capture. This is a core module for all the archives and records management students. In the module, we look at um, what information do organisations need to create? What formats do they need to capture it in? How long do they need to keep it? How do they best manage it? Um, and we think about obviously the time requirements for different information and archival considerations. This is also open as an option to other programmes. Um, I also teach a module called Managing Information Organisations. Um, this is a core module for the Library and Information Studies students. In this module, we look at um, management strategies to maximise information um, within organisations. So we look at marketing strategies for information about how to manage the budgets, how to manage people, when to use volunteers, when not to use volunteers. Um, and again, this is an option that's available um, to students beyond um, the Library and Information Studies programme. And then I teach an option which is open across UCL, which is on information governance, which we look at how to manage information um, for society ethically and responsibly, responsibly and looking at the kind of different laws that exist. Um, we think about this in international contexts and what are the different kind of challenges and disputes around things like privacy or openness. So we look at both the principles and how to kind of deploy different strategies into practice. And this kind of really fosters my research interest. So I'm interested in information management through time, risk management and information rights law. So I've just been chairing um, a um, committee looking at the general data protection regulation and some of the UK derogations around that and thinking about archival considerations. I'm also on a project called Mirror where we're looking at the rights of people who have been in care contexts and their sort of information needs and rights, given that often the information an organisation holds officially is their only memory of their childhood. So this is a really challenging and interesting project which has really beneficial social outcomes in terms of trying to provide people with better access to their information. Thank you.